Hello class, welcome to the first video of ME420 Finite Element Method. The first video will show you how to access Essence Workbench as a student of, at the University of Akron. So in general, there are two ways to access Essence Workbench. The first way is download free version of Essence. So to do that, you can open a browser. Let me open my Google Chrome. Here I will search Essence student version. Student version. And then search. The first item you can find is free student software on Essence website. So you can go down and Essence student, click here. After that, you will see download Essence Studio version 2020. And you click on it and scroll down. You will see a great download, and you can download it and install it on your own computer. So, to install it on your own computer, notice that there is a minimum requirement, and uh, you need four at least a four GB RAM and twenty five GB hard drive. They take a lot of space. Okay, there's a other way, second way, as a benefit of University of Akron, you can through access essence workbench through virtual lab. Let's see that how to go to virtual lab. In Google, search engine Google input virtual lab you acron and then search the first item click on it and then click on virtual lab and there are two ways to go into virtual lab one way is you install the app or you through the your brother so I would like to use the brother VMware horizon HTM access and there here you need input your UI account count so I will input my UI account count and then click login now you can see there are different desktops so what I want to go into is I will go into engineer 2020-21 I'll click on it and then bring me to uh, desktop and this is a remote desktop at, at uh, ME lab so you will see there are two control system uh, uh, there are two operating system one is the remote system which is located in my browser and the other one is my own computer remote computer and my own computer okay so Essence has been installed on the remote computer. So to open it, go to the search box of remote computer and input workbench. Okay. And then you will see that the workbench 2019 app has been there. Click on and then you will open Essence. So from there, we will start look at how to use them, which will be the content of the next lecture.